What up nerds? In this video I want to cover auto loads in C Sharp and with Godot. If you like this video and you want to support the channel, you can check out my Steam developer page. So let's get started. Now if you're not familiar with auto loads, they're kind of Godot's way of doing singletons, but they're not true singletons, and I'll explain that toward a bit towards the end. So first we want to have either a script or a scene. In my case, I'm just going to be using a script. Go to project settings, go to auto load, and then we just want to add it here by clicking on this folder, adding our script or no, uh, scene, and then you click add. So in this scene here, uh, just an example scene, all I have is one node with a script. So let's go ahead and take a look at what's going on here. Now, if we take a look here, it looks like pretty much any other node would. However, I do have this static getter for the instance. And I have a private setter for it. That way, only this class can actually set the instance. And this is the primary way you will probably be seeing other C Sharp developers uh, access their auto loads. And let's go ahead and look at how we can do this. Uh, this makes it very easy and quick to actually get the instance as demonstrated here in this line of code. And if you don't want to go with the instance uh, approach, having the instance property, this is how you would actually end up getting your auto load. You want to get the tree, then you want to start from the root node, and then you'll just do a regular get node call that is down to your auto load's name. And to demonstrate that this all works, let's take a little look here. We'll print the game manager name, which is what I have here. And let's go ahead and print this as well instance dot name and to differentiate them we'll go ahead and instance version and then we'll grab this slam it in there non instance version All right, so let's go ahead and switch over, run this, and you'll see that we get the same thing. And that pretty much covers this video, nice and quick. See you, nerds.